It's not just the case of Arsene having his groove back or Arsenal having their groove back in terms of the FA Cup's been won, there's a new confidence, they feel they don't have to be asked that dreadful question of totting up of years since Arsenal have won a trophy. So for the first time in a very long time, instead of the question being can Arsenal make it into the top four or will they be the ones to fall out, as is generally predicted, the question maybe is can they actually aim higher rather than looking over their shoulder and be looking to break the top three. There's a lot more to be excited about from an Arsenal perspective regarding the Alexis Sanchez transfer than just his unfeasibly short shorts. It's obviously been a, a transfer that has caused considerable excitement and I think there were comparisons made with the signing of Meza Ozil a year ago in the sense that here was Arsenal showing that they can go and buy a, a player that's very highly regarded and coveted um, throughout the world really. One would imagine that the idea is he brings out the best in Ozil, which will be something else I think Arsenal will be hoping will happen, that his second season will be with more confidence, he'll be more settled and perhaps enjoy the fact that there's not all onus on him or a lot of onus on him to be sort of the superstar, which perhaps doesn't suit Ozil, but having Sanchez around, having a player like Walcott coming back, suddenly there's going to be people that he can uh, use as assists with the best uh, intentions. Um, so that, that promises good things for Arsenal. So this is Paul Lambert's third season in charge at Villa Park and the two previous seasons he's managed a fairly miserable 15th 